Hello everybody and welcome to the Oscar Grand Prix Sprint Race. I have terrible flashbacks from this Grand Prix last year when I crashed into Alex Albon who came back onto the track like a madman at like 200 miles an hour. So hopefully we have a better time out this race uh, when we do get to it. So it's a sprint race first. We are on pole. Lewis is third. Someone separates us on in second and then you'll see the grid in a minute. So Lewis needs to start his intro now but I have got my dinner here so I might be eating while recording. So let's Hello and welcome here to the Austrian Sprint Race after a quick... Um, very good qualifying second from us, that takes us into third position, right behind George Russell and Jack with a storm of a lap, 1.7 seconds above the rest, which is very good for him. And last time out here in Austria, it was probably one of the biggest crashes we've ever seen in a two player, with Alex Albon coming back onto the track, hitting Lewis Hamilton, hit him first, which kind of slowed them down, and then Jack comes into him about 180 miles per hour, so that was probably one of the biggest crashes we'll ever see. So hopefully, we can try and. I mean, Albon did have a few crashes that race, so hopefully, we can just try and stay away from that and keep doing. What we've been doing in the last few races, we've got P3 in Spain, uh, P4 in Canada, so hopefully we can try and keep the top 5 run going and just try and keep myself in a championship battle for like kind of top 5 ish okay? And keep getting points for Alpine in the team. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Just about. Abu Dhabi just came out yesterday, so yeah. Oh yeah, we're having a wee break at the moment making top 10 videos, which one of them will come out today. Uh, actually two, one top for one on Lewis's channel, one on my channel. So let's just get into the sprint race and I can't wait to dominate. Probably. I think it's from here we go. So season two, Austrian sprint race is lights out. And away we go, let's go. Russell's had a good start but he's fumbled it in the second mm, phase. Yeah. Well, he's the coming thing back is, there, yeah. Um he is, he is. You're right. So this part here was where the massive crash was last year. I don't know if anything yeah, like there. that will happen again. Yeah. <laughs> I've got PTSD going past the corner in case anyone comes back up the track. I was a tiny bit injured after that, but nothing really major. I got to race next week, so no, it was all fine. Dion, oh no, there I might turn that and go for another video. And I've won to the gravel, Mr. B, the top three over. Man, around the final corner, we win the sprint Whoa, race. Oh, Russell's hit me. Russell's hit Lewis. Hamilton hit me, I mean. And Hamilton's also hit. Hamilton's up to no. P4. So I might Hamilton catch me. tiny rear, okay. Might catch, no I won't catch any of the battles, here we go, Lewis does get no, P3, Lando P2, it. Russell, Lewis in the wall, oh my days, there's a massive, there's a I was watching, I was watching a massive crash unfold and then it just cut to my, to my win. So, P3 will take it. Mm. 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 So everyone, hope you did enjoy the sprint race. If we'll take P3, we start at P3, we end the sprint race in P3. So we're P5 in the championship now. So we'll go for the P5. sprint and then we've won the sprint, so hopefully we can keep this form up in the race. See there, goodbye. Everybody. We're 123 points off chat 1, 2, 3. Hello everybody and welcome to the main race in Austria. So here we are then for the starting grid. We are on pole. Lewis is first. It's a McLaren 1, 2. For the start of this race, hopefully we can keep it. That is a brilliant result for both of us. And now everyone can just view the rest of the grid. Where is our teammate? Where is our teammate? I'll be PLS won't be anywhere near this race. There's a pair of people that have been unlucky then. They're not going to be unlucky, great, great, great place to be, but... Pair of falling back from quality. Medium for soft to be able to do that. Had enough of doing Ricardo had a penalty. And Joe Juan Yus have loads of penalties in this race for some reason. Not even that late in the season. Anyway, let's just focus on the race. Here we go. So, we're starting on the mediums, going to softs. Okay, trust the team. Let's just go for it. I'm going for a soft to medium. Gonna get stuck Ooh, in the start. Me and Lando are both on the softs. I mean, the mediums. While Lewis is on the softs, could he be a potential threat in this opening part of the race? That might be a strategy. Here we go then. Like I said, I'm going to go And look at Arthur, a good start. No, Arthur he's falling off it, exactly the first shot. Here I come, Here on the soft tyre. On the soft, it's three-way, into turn one. Yeah, I've what kept the leak, I'm all over this. Yeah, I saw that. I was all over the sausage car on the exit, because there was so many cars, but Lewis has got Lando. And then. Leclerc has also made an appearance on the soft tyres. Both McLaren and Mercedes on the mediums. Everyone, uh, Ferrari of Leclerc and Lewis are on the soft. They're charging in this early stage. And oh, Sonoda has now made an appearance on the soft. In the top <laughs> five, and there's yellow flags out as usual. Great start, Oscar is always a brilliant race in this game. Lewis down the inside. Down the inside. What in the overtake? I'm gonna get down on the soft tire now. I just need to I'm warm up my medium as quickly as possible. Lando well, Norris has fallen to P4. He obviously never warmed up his tires. George Russell has made it up to P3. I'm now starting to pull sure. away a tiny bit. Thank you. Thank you, Oh no! That's not good. 
<laughs> what happened control, there? I could not control my car for one here. He's made a comeback out of nowhere. Lewis on the inside. Will he go for it? He has went for it. And he's momentarily in the league, but I've got a better exit, I believe. Now, side by side, going um, to the Into first corner. Three. We're going to try and dance it around the outside here. And we've done it. It's a dance that takes us into the lead of the race. Yeah, you've done well there. Yeah, I've done well. Yeah. Yeah. Yellow, yellow flag. Yellow, someone's coming in the pits, I believe. Why would it be a safety got a, a red flag into the uh, someone retiring. I think mechanical Who? failure for an Aston Martin. I think it's oh. Piastri, I believe. Yeah, Oscar Piastri yeah. is at the second. No safety car. Oh yeah. Oh. So one retirement. Former McLaren driver. Yeah. And it's what's supposedly the best car on the grid. I do not believe that one bit. That's the mark. Yeah. So, now we get to the pit stop. What I think will be for our side as well. You, you're not coming in this lap. No. We're nearly behind North. Alright, into the pits we come on lap number 10 of the Grand Prix. My teammates have been feeling it. Russell's also in the pit lane. Albon will be coming in as well, but he's miles away from us. Get out, okay, mate, nice, it. Go, nice stop go, go. from the team that here. Russell stop. is, we I see him. No, I don't see him actually. I don't see him, Russell's dead, speed, there he is, there he is. He's on the hards, Russell on the hards! No softs available for Russell, he's on the hards! Oh, yeah, one really walked up into the that, pit lane corner. That's the first time an track. AI has never had any softs available. So that is big, because that means that everyone back. Alright, so we round the final two corners. Round in the final corner to win another Grand Prix in season two. It's been a dominant Australia, oh, Australian, Austrian Grand Prix. After a shaky start, we've managed to find our feet and extend the gap by a brilliant 21 seconds over George Russell, who's on the hards and will keep P2. Lewis gets a back-to-back -back podium in P3. Brilliant for him. Hamilton on course for P4. Leclerc's done a great job of sticking well, behind him. Podium Max, in three races won. Here. Max will only get very six. Good run. Albon said he's great result for him. The Perez is going to be very happy with that. In the points. Great day for Williams and Come great on. day for me and Lewis. So brilliant Grand Prix. That's a second podium in three races. I Come think on. it's our 11 for 12 race win here in Austria. Come on. Oof. Alright. There was not another Austria crash. We've managed to pull through. We've done it. Yeah. What a fantastic Grand Prix that was, and an excellent win for McLaren. And talk to me, what do you think it was that sealed the win for them? Well, time management probably played quite a large role in the outcome. So, this Jack wins, we kick on. It's not with just them. about speed, it's all about maintaining that speed consistently we give over, our a a hand, over a race distance. So, being able to keep up the lap times while still being smooth on the controls and gentle on the tyres, that's really where the race was won today. Will Jack do his famous boxing celebration? As the winners make yep. their way up to the podium, one can only imagine the celebrations that so will take that. place at McLaren tonight. Congratulations so to everyone got three on the team, the podium, securing basically. the win and mm -hmm. proving that they're a force to three be reckoned with four, out on the track. Mm -hmm. Jack if one wins again, he adds more points to his tally and Opens up the gap between him and Hamilton. So what is it now? What is it now? Um, I think I've won the championship already, to be honest. 76 points to Lewis Hamilton. We're, we're up to P5, one point off P4. So we can maybe try and be in a top, kind of, I think a top three battle. Like Lewis Hamilton's already got P2. Now Queen Rick trying to catch up with Negro in P4. So our teammate is nowhere to be found yet again. So we'll have, we'll have to scroll down to see him. P17 yet again. Hopefully we can maybe try and bring in a new teammate for me. But we'll see you for our home race next in Britain and then after that it's the team's home race. So it's been a brilliant so race. Quite important race for me and the team coming next. Overall, so we'll see you first. after a perfect weekend really. 21 points this weekend so we'll see you so I'm for now first, Britain. I'm still Goodbye. first in the Drivers' Championship. I've extended the gap by 76 points. George Russell, 100, 104 points off. Uh, so unless Hamilton is a miracle, I think I might have already won the championship in season 2. But let's not keep our hopes up. So. Lando Norris P4, Lewis P5, one point away from Lando, so that could be a battle in the constructors. McLaren are first by 47 points. That is going to be a very interesting fight if Lando cannot step up going into the final rounds of the season, I'm sure. 
Uh, Alpine are fourth actually in the in the constructors. They're doing well. We'll see you for the next race, our home race in Britain. Goodbye, everybody.